What up, though? I just want to get my thoughts on the 18 year old who got into an argument, 18 year old man who got into an argument with a 12 year old little girl. And he ended up shooting her. And like a coward, he took off. Listen, man. I hope the police don't find you. I hope the family find you first. Because you a coward, man. Anytime you get into an argument with a 12-year-old girl, something is not right in your head, man. Like, you're not dealing with a full deck. To pull a pistol out and shoot her, you a coward, man. A pure-blooded coward. And I hope the family find you first before the cops do. And I hope they uh, put in that work. You know, what, what, what did this 12-year-old little girl do so bad to the point you had to roll up your sleeves pull your weapon out that's probably illegal and shoot this little girl man we gotta do better man we gotta get it together man you know he should be held accountable and I just think the family should hold him accountable that's why I said I hope the family find him first you know what I'm saying I, th I think street justice should be should prevail and don't get me wrong, I'm not no, you know, just this old vigilante, you know, type uh, individual who thinks that, uh, you know, all street justice should be taken out on the individual who uh, does the crime, you know. But at the same time, something like this. I think street justice should be uh, implemented. You know, you 18 years old, man. 18. Ain't no way you should be arguing with a 12-year-old girl who's probably not even high in high school, who's still in junior high, and you pull a, a pistol out and shoot her? Man, you know, if I was the father, man, I'd be out looking for you, man. I'd be at your family's house. I'd be at your homie's house. I'd be everywhere looking for you, man. On 90 Crip. When I see, when I see you, you're going to have to, you, you will have to get that issue, man. Even if I had to go to jail, you will have to get that issue. You will have to get that, man. You shoot my daughter. And I hope the family is out looking for you, man. Let this be a lesson, man, to all you youngsters out there, man. Man, start, man. It's, it's another way, man. I'm not saying that you got to be a coward about it. But you don't want to do, you don't want to throw your life away, man. You don't want to do life in jail, man. I'm trying to tell you, man. When you get behind them walls, man. And you think you tough right now? When you get behind them walls, you're going to see some individuals who are uncut, breathe, sleep, eat, fight. That's all they do, man. That's all they wake up doing. So if you think you tough and you want to do that time, then go ahead and throw your life away. Because my man, he threw his life away. He going to do some time when they catch up with him. When they catch up with him, they, they, you know what I'm saying? They're going to give him some time behind that. That ain't shit hooster about that, what he did. Ain't nothing hooster about what he did. That shit just shows he's a motherfucking coward. That's all that shows is he's a, he's a coward. And I don't know if his parents raised him well or not. You know what I'm saying? I'm not the judge and jury behind that. I don't know. His parents could have raised him the best they could. I don't know. I wasn't there with, with, with them. But what I do know is that the decision making that he made, it cost him his life. 
Because he's going to go do some time if the family don't find him first. Y'all stop taking that taking that uh, easy route, pulling the pistol all the time. You know what I'm saying? If you got if you got a if you got an issue with somebody, man, 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 dissolve that shit, man. Have a conversation or go in the backyard and y'all knuckle the fuck up and call it quits. It's too many individuals out here, youngsters throwing their life away, pulling that gun, and then when they get to jail, then they start thinking about what the fuck they doing. Then they realize that, man, I fucked up. But it's too late. Your parents been trying to tell you. Some of your homies, that's, that's your real homies been trying to tell you. You know what I'm saying? And now you stuck in that system. Asshole, butt ass naked in that system. It's easy to get up in there. It's hard to get out, though. I know. I know for a fact. So, you know what I'm saying? To the 18-year-old that, that shot this 12-year-old girl, you a coward. You a bitch-ass coward. And I hope the family finds you. And I hope they deal with you accordingly. Salute.